Now, we have had cases of people coming back to soaps. Of course. Well, you can't, cos you, you were <laughs> no, pushed off. Right. <laughs> 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 we're in heaven together. <laughs> You can't go back. But there have been rumours sometimes of a reunion of Only Fools and Horses. Is yes, that ever going to happen, do you think? Well, there is a big, a big hoo-ha now because there are going to be five-hour-long specials, a sort of documentary, where they're looking at um, how, the, how the show was made, but scenes backstage, and why it had such an impact. Um, I, I don't know how good that'll be, mm. but five one-hour episodes will just be... It's like it, a tribute to John it, Sullivan. tribute to John yeah, Sullivan. Yeah, he was an amazing And, and I think it will be... We've done a bit of filming. It's been quite nice getting back into Marlene's leopard print. A <laughs> <laughs> rumour about a boob job. Well, no, Marlene, we were talking about people wanting to change themselves, and Marlene always wanted big boobs. Ah. And did, I got a call from John Sullivan once saying, um, we're going to write a storyline with Marlene having a boob job. I thought they were going to give me a boob job. <laughs> Ten seconds left. <laughs> which I have to say. Could you just give us a little bit of Marlene to say goodbye to the loose women? Oh, I watch I you know. every week. I love it. Well, I, I know, over and over I know you're all sad, boy. She ain't here, but it don't travel well. <laughs> <laughs>